Bald eagles, once an endangered species, are on the rise in New England. They're nesting in places they've been absent from for decades, such as the Wachusett Reservoir in Boylston. Worcester News Tonight's Melissa Tupin went on an eagle cruise today and joins us with what she saw. Melissa. Chet, with a pair of binoculars in hand, you may be able to catch a glimpse of some of these bald eagles. There are currently four living on the Wachusett Reservoir in Boylston, and officials say that number is on the rise. Look closely and you might catch a glimpse of a bald eagle flying around Wachusett Reservoir in Boylston. Twenty years ago, you wouldn't have been so lucky. The national bird was on the endangered species list. But the eagle's return to the Bay State is no accident. We thought we'd jumpstart that comeback by introducing young birds into their former range here in Massachusetts. Bill Davis of the state's Division of Fisheries and Wildlife Check was out. part of a team bringing more than 40 eaglets to habitats around the state. They were released once they were able to fly. That was nearly 25 years ago. And since that time in the 1980s, these birds have matured, paired off, set up nesting territories, and the population is just beginning to explode. Every spring, state fish and wildlife biologists visit as many nests as they can to tag the baby chicks with bands like these. Since 1989, more than 330 eagles have been accounted for in Massachusetts. Four eagles call the Wachusett home, two new chicks born this spring, and their parents. Biologists believe they came here from the Quabbin Reservoir on the western edge of central Massachusetts, where ten pairs remain. It wouldn't surprise me at all in the future if we had uh, more pairs than the one we have just now. Dan Clark of the Department of Conservation and Recreation says reservoirs like the Wachusett provide a perfect environment for the species. There's plenty of trees, fish, and very little to bother them since recreational boating isn't allowed. As long as you have the habitat and you sort of have the, the source population, they'll, they'll find it and they'll, they'll set up shop and, and do their thing. Davis says the future for the eagles is looking bright. They were taken off the federal endangered species list back in 2007, and he's hopeful they'll be removed from the Massachusetts list soon. Until then, he'll keep counting and watching. Now, this summer's eaglets should be reaching maturity for breeding in about four to five years. At that point, biologists hope that they return to the Wachusett Reservoir to start another cycle of eagle breeding. Chet, back to you. Good enough. Thank you. Melissa Tupin reporting.